How to navigate the test screen. This is how you navigate the Eclipse test screen. The test screen is where all your waveforms are located. As part of the test screen, you have this function called volt per division. You can click these two arrows to increase or decrease the volt per division. This increases or decreases the display of the volt per square, which either makes the waveform bigger or smaller. This is only a display setting and it does not change anything else. The FMP and residual noise graph in the top of the screen acts as a quality measure for each waveform. A high quality waveform has a high FMP and a low residual noise. The bars will turn green when the FMP and residual noise reach their stop criteria. When this happens, you can be confident in the presence or absence of the response. The EEG and rejection level are here in the upper right hand corner of the test screen. You can only adjust the rejection level when there is no active recording. The EEG, as seen on the right, shows the electrical noise of your surroundings, which will influence your measurement. You can adjust the rejection to such a degree that no sweeps will be rejected. However, the lower the EEG, the less noise introduced to the measurement. Electrical noise can be from PCs, an MR scanner in your building, or if your patient is not relaxed. The rejection level is here in microvolts. If the EEG turns red like this, then the EEG exceeds your rejection level and the sweeps will be rejected.